Good morning, folks. This is Longshot1982 here with another statue review. Today I'm super excited to bring to you the Sideshow premium format version of Storm. Now, Storm is uh, one of the newer X-Men, as displayed here in Giant Size X-Men number one in her first appearance. Storm's real name is Aurora Monroe, and she was actually a uh, priestess, or they saw her as a priestess, in uh, the country of Kenya in Africa. Uh, Kenya is south of Somalia, Eritrea, and Djibouti. It's in that eastern uh, section of Africa. Uh, for those of you who don't know geographically where it's located. And uh, the people there, you know, the tribes and stuff, they begged her, they begged upon her to help it make it rain, not make it rain on them hoes, make it rain like with the storm, make it rain, grow great crops for the year. So they kind of like worshipped her as a goddess. She comes from a long line of African witch priestesses, but her father was a photojournalist. Go freaking figure, right? Um, now, they were, they were living in Harlem, and then they moved to Egypt, where shortly uh, her parents died during the Suez War, which is also known as the Arab, is the second Arab-Israeli War, for those of you who don't know who that is. Now, Storm was the survivor, obviously, and uh, she spent many years surviving on the streets after befriending a street thief, you know, but her friend, you know, the street thief was, you know, unaware of her, of, her, of her powers, really, uh, but, you know, she was able to survive, and then she, uh, Xavier later took her uh, under his, uh, his wing, and uh, the rest is pretty much history. Uh, this is the piece that I wanted to get over the 1980s version of Storm with that horrible, ridiculous punk hair, and as you can see right here, this is what she's supposed to look like, right? And here she is, the Storm Premium Format by Sideshow Collectibles. Now look at that face, that calm, cool, collective, stoic face. She's, she has her hand out like she's going to summon the elements. The, uh, my favorite part about this statue is the, uh, the rump, which is crafted absolutely just wonderfully. It's nice and big. It's plump. It's a nice big juicy butt. You know, it's probably one of my favorite, if not my favorite sculpted ass on any premium formats I have. My first before was Madame Hydra. I think Storm's going to take it because I do dig those delicious black booties. But what really, really impressed me wasn't even the statue of Storm itself. It's this base. It's the top of a mountain, the peak of it, and it shows all the moss got all these wonderful flowers. It shows all of that delectable detail that we like in these sideshow pieces. Let me stand across this way. The cape is fully posable. It's got wire throughout the entire thing. It's absolutely fantastic. This base is heavy. She's solid through, especially around the rump part, which is good. You want it to be, you always want a nice solid rump. Uh, the, the hair is flowing all the way down to the base of her back, and that her head is one solid sculpted piece. It's, it's detached. The packaging for this was actually really amazing. The box isn't too big. Uh, it was packed actually very neatly. It comes with two hands. It comes with this hand, which is the way I like to display it, right there with her kind of with her palm up, summoning the elements. And it's got another one with her hand kind of down. doesn't really do anything for me. Uh, this piece, I will give a 8.5 out of 10. And the only reason why I would give it a lower score is because I've been told I haven't been critical enough with my pieces. This is really a nice piece. The body is sculpted. My favorite part about it, though, besides the butt, what I think is a very hard thing to do is this little ring right here that they have that's uh, connecting her costume pieces together. I think that was really, you know, a nice hard thing. It's hard to do. It's hard to sculpt that. It's always hard to sculpt the female body, even the musculature on the side, the birthing hips, and the supple lips, this beautiful sculpted lips, puckered. There's no way to describe this other than sheer perfection. Uh, the sacrilege that they made is in the form of a comiquette. I mean, 
it's nothing to me. If, if she had really, if you saw my review of her, I, I don't particularly care for it. Some people do. That's their opinion. And that's cool too. But uh, this is the piece I had to get. This is her. This is what Storm is all about. This shows, captures her expression in the character that she truly is. So that's going to be it today, folks, for uh, my review. Uh, please sub me and please comment. I'd love to know what you think of this uh, review. You guys are wonderful. Have a great day.